Hello friends, it's Terry with Terry's Milk. Go back to my when the red arrow shows up in the lower right hand corner of your screen, I'd love it if you would click on it and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I post all kinds of different, different cards from different companies. So again, today I'm working with Altenew, and this is their new Whimsical Flower Bunch coloring sheets along Space Garden alcohol marker sets that it has just been released. So again, I'm showing you all of the different sheets that you have to choose from. These are six by six printed, um, appropriate for alcohol markers, you know, pencils, whatever it, whatever it is you use. Um, but again, you have both a dark, um, outline and then you have a lighter outline that would be perfect for no line coloring so I'm kind of showing you all the different uh, choices you have I chose this particular one um, I liked the way it was kind of mid in the center and I thought it would make um, make an interesting card so here are those space garden alcohol markers so again you get them 12 to a box and these are very vintagey type of colors and I always start by making just a real small swatch card and again I keep that inside the boxes so that I can uh, choose my colors as I'm moving along so again you can see here I'm I'm filling them in and adding um, you know the darker color for additional shadows etc I mean the nice thing as I said you get 12 markers in the box and this one happens to have purples um, some greens, blues, and some yellows, yellows and oranges. So again, aren't they a cool vintage -y type looking color? I thought they were really pretty. So again, I'm just kind of moving along here, coloring as I go. I just thought this was pretty and I liked these colors. I think they're, um, you know, they're very, vintage is the best word I could use for them because again they are kind of um, muted um, you know they're not real bright colors so again I'm just continuing to color and you can see here I'm just about done I'm gonna grab a darker uh, darker blue kind of fill in some of these some of these spots here and then we will be completely done there it is isn't that pretty so I'm thinking about cutting it at an angle um, and creating kind of an angled card here so um, I did I pulled it right out and used my tonic trimmer and just cut it right down the middle <laughs> at an angle so I ended up with two pieces so I'll be able to make two unique cards with this so I used the piece on the left and I'm kind of lining it up with an A2 card base and I'm going to um, attach it on there and then I'll pull out another trimmer and uh, trim it down, the excess piece there. So again, it fits right on there. And then I decided I wanted to add a, a colored strip onto this particular card. So again, I'm uh, gonna kind of play with it here. And you can see here that I ended up um, coloring it with the lighter purple color. And I decided I didn't like that, so I went back and colored over it with one of the one of the darker purples, um, and I thought that looked much better. So again, this, this is kind of where it's going to go. I trimmed it in half, so it ended up to be just a quarter inch strip. And so I'm gluing it on there, and then I'll trim that off, and then I move on to the um, the sentiment, that fun hello. So I decided to add a little bit more, more interest here, pulled out one of the darker, um, you know, darker, darker pens and decided to add a little more color. So here's that hello I was talking about. Um, I decided to, I trimmed that, cut it out of uh, two pieces of a dark blue um, cardstock, and then I'm going to heat emboss the I've been thinking about you sentiment there on the front in white. Um, so again, I really, I love this, uh, this set. I've used it in several of my cards. Um, I will post a link to it in the description below. So again, I'm just going to take my glue and glue it on here. Whoop. <laughs> okay. So I got a whole bunch of glue that popped out there. So I'm going to go ahead and use my finger and spread it around. I must've had a had a clog in there or something that cut loose all of a sudden. 
So again, I'm just going to attach that down at the bottom here. Isn't that pretty? I thought the blue just matched, um, you know, matched the color of that blue in the alcohol markers. And I just thought it really accented the front of this card well. So again, here is the final card. And I'll show you another picture of it here coming up soon. There you go. There's that card again, and there's that hello die. Again, this is Terry with Terry's Mailbox. I'm on Instagram, Facebook. I have a blog on Blogger and YouTube channel. I'd love to have you follow me, subscribe, make comments. Um, take care. Have a great day.